Hello, my name is Amy Eric and welcome to my channel. So today I'm doing this cool tone blue look and it is a retro kind of look. So thank you Miss Daphne for giving me a challenge to try. It was definitely fun. I do have some more ideas to maybe do a tweak on the blue eye. So got a little crazy today. It's kind of bright, kind of cool, kind of retro. Love it. So anyways, if you'd like to see how I created this eye look, Stay tuned. Okay, so we're prepped and primed and eyebrows and face and everything is on. So let's see what we can create with some blues. I'm gonna start with Winky Lux all over the eye. And this color is in light. Hoping if I get a good light base, I'll get more of a pop of blue. Okay, from the Kat Von D palette, this is, let's see, we're going to pick up this light gray color, and looks like it, it's Melancholia. Next, we're going to pick up a bit of this blue here, and it's called Indigo. How's that for some 80s going on? Love it. Okay, so I'm going to go back to Kat's palette and I'm going to use some mezzanine with some hybrid moments. So um, I don't know that that's dark enough, so we're going to mix these two together. If I was smart, I would have waited to put my foundation on because it looks like I've got fallout and it's a hot mess. Oh, that swept away easy. Yay, it swept away easy. I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit more of that light from Winky Lux up underneath my eyebrow. And underneath the eye, we're going to use the blue and gray again from this cat palette. We're going to use these two. Okay, we're gonna line the waterline with some black, and this is Milani. It's a waterproof eyeliner. And we're gonna use the Elf and Charcoal for the upper lash line. I'm going to put a light coat of mascara on my eyes. This is from Siete London, the Wonder Wand Mascara, and this was from the Chloe Morello when she launched her palette. Okay, I'm going to put a little bit of lash glue down in some key spots where my eyelashes lift. I lied. I'm going to use a dab of Atlantis, and this is from Makeup Geek. Just to add a little bit more sparkle. Okay, so I'm gonna add a little bit of, now I'm going to add a little bit of the Tarte eyelash glue on a few key areas on my eye where the makeup action, or ma <sighs> that the eyelashes lift. So I'm gonna do a little bit on the inner corner not inner corner, but the inner lash line and then the external. Usually right in the middle, I don't have problems with them popping. It's always those edges. Darn those edges. So I know this technique is not the right technique for women to do their eyelashes. It works for me. All right, so now we're gonna use the Ardell 110s. This is a natural multi-pack, cause yeah, this eye look is natural, right? I'm a natural ice queen. 
Okay, so while those are drying, we're gonna just take the e.l.f. and go along the eyelash line again so that um, anything that I may have covered up, we go ahead and fix and make the lash line look smooth. Then for the inner corner, we're gonna use some blue sapphire from Kat Von D. Okay, so this is the final cool blue color look. Very retro, kind of fun. Thank you so much for watching today. I appreciate you taking the time to watch me create a cool tone, really retro blue eye. It was very fun to do. If you have any comments, please put those below. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, make it a beautiful day.